for quite a few things going on not really so this is one of the herb boxes and i will be harvesting these with the leaves today so i'm going to harvest them and then i'm going to do a video on what i will be making with them um it's quite hot today today's saturday i believe today's the ninth um and we're going to harvest some parsley as well we're going to harvest some herbs as well because i'm going to wash them and put them to dry before the sun goes out meaning for this time um, because this is england you know that the weather is not favorable all the time so that's what i'm going to be doing and um, yes yeah, so i'm going to just get sort these out and harvest them as well i don't know if you want me to show you me harvesting them i'll just quickly show you what i'm going to harvest and then show you i think that's what i'm going to do show you what i'm going to harvest just in case the video is going to be long so you know that i'm going to be harvesting these leaves as well that i spoke about i'm not quite sure what they're what they they are not quite sure what they are i did speak about them in my previous video but nobody left a comment saying what they are so i don't know anyway we will be harvesting them today and um yeah so we're gonna harvest a few things i might be harvesting beetroot as well so let's show you that before i harvest it so you know that it's quite hot today so you see there's one let's see i don't know if you can see there's one down here you can see there's a beetroot down there so i might be harvesting this one there's some other ones some busy carrots as well you can see those three carrots beetroots here as well i really want to leave them until they're quite big so although i'm saying i'm going to harvest them today i don't really think i want to harvest them but i don't want them to start going to seeds oh this is a massive carrot let's pick this one out let's get this one it's not even that big but look at it that's what i realized they've been i'm gonna have to cut it off because i don't want to break okay cut it out so that's one short i've been snacking on them for lunch i've been harvesting them every morning to have for lunch um yes yeah, so that's what i'm doing and um, this one i'm gonna snack on um some because i want to make a salad so that's why i wanted to harvest at least one beetroot so so far i've harvested my cucumber you can see here which i showed you in another clip this morning i went in and i harvest this one here so we're gonna pop it here starting in some tomato starting on some parsley as well right around here so let's see how we get on today harvesting but we're just gonna fill this little basket with whatever we can find in the garden wow so beautiful sun is out let's cut some of these leaves so i just harvest them just like this um I don't want to take too much off this plant here so i'm gonna go and get some more from somewhere else but i only want the big leaves just the big leaves these are the only ones that i want okay i need to suit up the microwave it's coming off so i'll be back and this is what i've harvested so far from these two plants here is it two or one one sorry this is just this that's just one plant and I've harvested this. So um, as I said before, I'm taking the bigger leaves. So these are the ones I'm taking. And then I'm gonna go over that side. Let's see to this camera here. I'm going over that side to get these ones here and get some from here as well. So that's what I'm gonna do, but I'll show you what they look like after. So I'm not gonna be videoing this bit. Okay, bye. This is what we've got from my leaves. This is my tiger stripe ones. I only use these for sauce as well. They're not that sweet. I don't think I'm going to be growing them next year. I might just grow just one because I want to change up what I have been growing so far. I didn't grow any um, cherry tomatoes this year, so I might grow some next year. I'm not quite sure, but I will grow my beef tomatoes because they are looking lovely. Um, so those ones I will grow indeed. So this is what the little tiny basket is looking like. 
Uh, mind you, I have got a cucumber in here. It's my first harvest of cucumber. Um, I have been harvesting my carrots. This one is quite small. I expect it to be a lot bigger. But anyway, that's what we've got so far in the basket. And um, we have a little parsley here. Let's pop it in here for now. So that's what the basket is looking like. I need to get some more parsley and I'll get some herbs as well. Some sage. The parsley, I already showed you. I'm going to pop it on the screen here what I normally use with, do the parsley with because I don't know what to do with parsley, but this is what I've been doing with parsley. And um, it has been working out perfectly for me, so I have been growing them a lot. So now I know what to do with them. So I am happy. So I've got some here and then I'm going to get some more in order to make what I'm going to make later on for lunch next week. Okay, bye. See you next clip. I'm still harvesting beans not a lot at the moment but it's still producing so i will have some a lot more soon in a few weeks time so yeah still producing a few more things so basket is looking lovely and it's very hot these are my purple sage so we're just gonna pop them i'm just gonna pop them in here and then some of the leaves down here as well so purple sage in I'm going to get some more sage as well. So I just harvested the garlic chives and um, I washed it before I showed it to you guys because it was covered, completely covered with black aphids or whatever you want to call them. So I just washed them. These ones, I want to split it because it's getting quite big, I think. Um, so I want to split it, but I'm not quite sure when is the right time to split it. So, um, so to put it in another box, so put it in so it can be grown in two separate her, um, her boxes so that's my reasoning behind splitting it and i might get more out of it so what i'm gonna do now is get these to try because i'm gonna put this with the the purple leaf purple leaves things that i just harvested which i don't know what they are <coughs> but i've been eating them since last year so it's fine it's not gonna kill me um so what i'm gonna do now is uh, i'm gonna let this to dry and then these ones i need to wash as well and put them to dry as well and then this, I might just pop it, I have no idea where, so I might just pop it here for now. I don't know if you cut it from down here, but that's what I do. I purchase salary from Sainsbury's, the organic ones. And then I use the top of it and then I save the bottom bit and I plant the bottom bit. And that's that. So, I now decided that i'm going to harvest them look at that that is so lovely i'm so pleased and the top bit the leaf bit i will be using i don't throw away anything because remember that i'm on a vegetarian diet so i'm a plant-based person so nothing goes to waste in my garden and i mean nothing nothing goes to waste in my garden i find ways and means to use them and yeah, so let's show you what it looks like. I don't know, the glare of the sun, is it? This is one stalk of it. Yeah, so let's show you what they look like after I put them together in the basket. And this is it, but I don't think I can put it in the, the basket. So let's put it where you can see it. So this is what I harvested. But I'll show you everything to you properly later on when I finish harvesting. So this is some more sage that I harvested and I'm going to pop these in the basket. Another sage. So let me take you through my little harvest that I've done this morning. So we have cucumber, carrot, some tomatoes. We have got four different types of tomato here. This is my first harvest of my beef steak. So I took it up because it started ripening. So I decided to, I, sorry, I harvested it's dark ripening then you have some runner beans and some french climbing beans here as well i have harvested all of my leeks so my baby leeks as you can see they are lovely i've washed them already um then i harvested some thyme pop that there some parsley as well i've harvested two good and then here this is what i've harvested um this morning so this is the one that smells like licorice and tastes like licorice. So I just washed it, tied it up so that I can put it to air dry for a little bit. 
Then we have three different types of sage. As you can see, one. We have this one here, variegated one. This is the crop one, and this is just the normal sage. So we have three bundles of that, and then here I've got my part, my my celery from regrowing celery. So let's show you what it looks like. A little time going on there. So that's it. The regrowing celery. So that's what I've got there. So I'm pleased with that. Got these right here. You can see. Oh, I forgot. I haven't showed you my. This is. This is my um, chives, my garlic chives as well. So we have quite a lot of things harvested um, today from my little tiny London garden. So yes, yeah, so this is what I've got. And I'm very pleased with today's harvest. Bye.